Welcome back to Booze on the Rocks. My name is David Edwards, and today we're gonna to use these to make the bramble. But first, this. Let's get into the history of the bramble. Now, the bramble is the brainchild of Richard Bradsell, AKA the Cocktail King. Now, the bra black this blackberry drink is arguably the most famous of his creation from his time at Fred's Club in Soho during the 1980s. Richard was the bar's manager at Fred's on Carlisle Street, and was it was the ultimate 80s member club. Now, he wanted to invent a truly British drink. He failed, Th those are his words. Now, as Dick says, he couldn't find acceptable creme de mure and lemons aren't native to our cloudy climes. He called it the bramble after the blackberry brambles that he used to climb through as a kid on the Isle of Wight. So let's get into making the bramble. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab my cocktail shaker and my, or my shaking glass to be more specific. I'm going to add some ice, of course, because we like ice, right? Pretty, isn't it? Okay. Now this is a, dr a gin drink and we, and I'm going to use some Bombay Sapphire gin is what I have on the shelf right now. And Rick Dick said that this was a drink that is a good gateway and introduction drink to gin. Now we've got here some uh, gin. We're going to use two ounces or 60 mils of this gin right here. And of course, one of the next thing we need to do is we need to sour this up. So we're going to use a lemon, but not just any lemon. Yes, a lemon I got at a grocery store that does not come from the climates in England. But we need three quarters of an ounce or one or close to one ounce of lemon juice. Again, depending on how sour you like this. And depending on the size of the lemon will depend on exactly how much lemon juice you actually get out of this. Like that half a lemon actually gave me the correct amount. I'm very impressed. Now we've made it a little bit sour. So what we're going to do now is we're going to make this a little bit sweet. So we're gonna use three quarters of an ounce of a simple syrup. Now this simple syrup is a one to one mixture, one, uh, one part sugar, one part water. And now we gotta shake the crap out of it for about 30 seconds. Now those are his directions. I'm making this classically the way he did and I watched him actually do a video on this. And as we do this, the, uh, the ice actually breaks apart the citrus juice. All right, so here we are, we're gonna use a rocks glass. And I'm going to make this in the correct way that, uh, that Dick did this. And the reason he said they used crushed ice was because the restaurant that was next to the bar, which was the ice machine they used, used to do, had a Christ crushed ice machine. So that was the type of ice that he used. Make this nice and full here. Using my Hawthorne strainer, of course, we are now going to pour these ingredients directly over. And I've overfilled my glass, but that's okay. We're gonna have quite an interesting effect happen anyways. Now, the other thing that we used is, he used a creme de mur, creme de mur, which is a blackberry liqueur. Now, you can't get a good creme de mur in England at the time that he said this. So I'm using a Chambord, which is what I have that was available in the local liquor, liquor store close to me. And we're gonna use three quarters of an ounce or about 22 and a half mils. And what we're going to do is we're going to float this on top. Let's see if I can do this without, and this is exactly the way he suggests that we do that. 
Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. But now we need to garnish this. So I'm going to use a lemon slice because there's lemon in this. And I'm really seem to be spilling all over the place, but we will fix that problem. And the last thing we need to make this remind us of the blackberry brambles that he actually climbed through as a kid on the Isle of Wight is a little bit of blackberry. And here we have the bramble. Dick Bradsell's classic British drink that's not really completely classically British. Let's see how it tastes. Oh yeah, A-list drink all the way. You know what? Really good, I recommend it to everybody. You know what, I'm gonna leave the ingredients down below. You tell me what you would use, a different type of uh, gin, different type of blackberry liqueur. And you know what? I'm really interested to hear this and I think it would be a really good discussion. Please leave a comment below. If this is your first time to our channel, please hit the subscribe button and make sure you hit the bell notification so that we can get notifications every time we place a new video online. But if, this, if you didn't like this video, you didn't find it entertaining or interesting, hit the thumbs down button twice. And we'll see you next time. So let's get into the history of the Bramble. The Bramble is the brainchild of Richard Bur Bradsell, AKA, never mind, stop it.